It's also that countries have karma. There's there's so many layers to this that to me, it's a very strange focus when you're talking about social justice of any kind, or when and I and I find the issue of blame and shame the most disturbing thing about yeah. this. And the, and the blame yeah. and shame is complete attachment or right or wrong thinking. Right? It you know? truly transforms people when they start to have a broader image. You know, another thing that this makes me think of is that when you get to Paravda Karma and this idea that, you know, every soul has a set of learning that it's here to do, it's also that countries have karma, have Paravda Karma. The planet has its own Paravda Karma. And so sometimes I think what's very disturbing when only the law of attraction is focused on is it's very, it's a very strange focus when you're talking about social justice of any kind or when you're talking about, you know, sexism, homophobia, racism, uh, you know, all the isms, ageism, that when, you know, pretending that those things don't exist and that there's a larger social karma that's making those things happen. And then you say to people, oh, yeah, you know, you're Hispanic and you didn't get that job. You think it's because you're Hispanic, but really you created that. And you're ignoring that there's a larger social reality, social karmas that are getting worked out. There's there's so many layers to this that to me, it truly transforms people when they start to have a broader image that, um, yes, the law of attraction is true, but so are so many things. It would be a little bit like saying you're only a brain instead of knowing that you're a heart, you have a, you know, you have a soul. It's, it's, it's just confining reality into a very tiny box. Yeah. And that's actually a beautiful example because, you know, we're the whole entirety of our body, but then our, our heart is operating, you know, separate, but together and our stomach is digesting our food and our liver and this and that. But you know, if you look at any one piece, you can say, okay, that is true of that, but it's also, there's a whole system going on, right? And, yes. you know, something that's happening maybe in the pancreas is going to be affecting everything else. Exactly. You know? Exactly. You enjoying this so far? Did you forget to subscribe? Make sure to do so. It takes two seconds. Just press that little button, the red one, you know, the one, just press it, little like, all right, enjoy the rest of this content. And I, and I find the issue of blame and shame the most disturbing thing about this, the way that people blame themselves when wishes don't come true or when things are restricted or the way that they subtly or not so subtly blame others. You yeah. must have done something wrong. If only you had done this or that. And I think that part of that is coming from fear that someone's saying, like particularly in the case of an illness, say, someone's saying, I don't want to believe that can happen to me, so I'm going to make this about your limitation of your mind. Yeah. Now, again, that standing inside of that paradox, it doesn't mean that the law of attraction, of course it works, and if you're always sending hatred and blame and resentment into your body, of course it has effect but the idea is that so many other things operate too environmental karmas operate it's it's really the like the compassionate thing is to hold a larger image than just this narrow rigidity of blame and shame yeah and the, and the blame and shame is complete attachment or right or wrong thinking right you know this is good or this is bad this is you know you created this illness, you created that, and then and then people literally feel that they did something wrong. And and then, right. but, you know, maybe they did something right to even, uh, exactly. you know? Exactly. If you like this content, make sure that you like, subscribe, and comment below. And we also have amazing link right there for some cool product. I know you want to check it out. I know you want to click it. Go ahead, go ahead. Come on, you can do it. All right, until next time. Have a beautiful, blessed day.